Southern Cross in Hootspruit offers a unique learning environment in the breathtakingly beautiful Low Felt. Based in an 1100 hectare wildlife estate, the school is an English medium co-educational day and boarding school. It balances high academic standards with an exceptional quality of life. Southern Cross has grown since its establishment in 2002. The school offers pre-primary, preparatory and secondary education with boarding from grade 6 and it attracts learners from 17 countries. I'm going to start off by saying had the school been around when my children were going to school, I would have sent them here. Had the school been around when I was going to school, I would have wanted to be at the school. You know, Southern Cross is all about getting children into nature. And so the, the natural bush around us has served as, as the, part of the, the learning environment for the children. The fact that we're in a nature reserve gives us a, an incredible access to natural resources. So the, the idea is that um, we'll develop children that will have an environmental conscience. The school uses nature-based teaching and learning to deliver the national curriculum. Wherever possible, learning is linked to the natural environment. Nature inspires children in ways that textbooks can't, allowing Southern Cross to educate like no other independent school. What makes the school so special is the quality of Southern Cross's education, combined with the rich natural environment. I think Southern Cross as a whole is unique. It's a wonderful school, a fantastic environment to be in where the children from this early age are integrated with the whole school. We share lessons with college children, um, we go to assembly with the prep, the children have IT from the stage, so they're learning computer skills, drama, um, bush law, and we have um, swimming lessons as well. So they're in integrated into everything that's happening in the school and then they're ready for grade one. It's not foreign to them, you know, they're going into something that they already know, they're comfortable with the older children. So it's um, a lovely environment for them to be involved in. The bush allows us to look at an, a holistic approach to education using the natural environment as well as work on individuality within each child and allow them to grow as they grow on their own. We came here for our kids and I, I can't say that we made a mistake, it's been the best, best move I've made. You couldn't have a better place for children to grow up. I think back to the days when I grew up, when the phrase when kids were kids and honestly that's what you have here. You know, our kids are able to walk around, they are involved with so many different things. Yes, I know we focus on nature, but it's a whole lot more than that. Children are allowed to express themselves, they're allowed to be free with, within the parameters that we set. We offer everything that any other school does and more. We offer a, a family and, and that I think is very, very important. Um, I think it, it offers something unique for each child. I mean, Every subject and every teacher can offer something that will broaden that child's horizons or that child's future. So I think whether it be bush law, whether it be math, whether it be science, whether it be um, English, I think each child can get what they need out of that specific subject and use it to their advantage. I think that it's made me feel like, because the rest of the world is a very hostile place and here everybody's like, they're friends and they, they care for each other. Um, you can tell the difference between a black rhino and a white rhino. A black rhino eats leaves and it's got a pointy lip and the white rhino has a square lip because it eats grass. Southern Cross is great! Over the years the school's definitely developed its, its own identity. Um, every private school has its own identity and ours happens to be brought on as a, as a result of the environment that we sit in. Um, it creates great learning opportunities where learning becomes more tangible to the, to the learners as opposed to being stuck in a classroom. Um, the classrooms are more, more sort of in tune with the bush, nothing's square, everything's rounded, um, nothing's predictable. And uh, I find personally that the, the learners respond a lot better in terms of their learning as a result of the environment that they sit in. Grade 12 learners sit the National Senior Certificate exams, administered by the Independent Examination Board, and they come away with an internationally recognized certificate. The school boasts a 100% matric pass rate, with all learners achieving bachelor degree or diploma passes. The, the nature-based uh, emphasis in the school takes nothing away from the academic side of things. 
Um, we are an academic school. Our children write the IEB exams and depending on the subject combinations that they choose, they could walk into any of the major fields that would uh, take them to become captains of industry. Our most recent matric results were outstanding. Um, very proud of the fact that uh, we had a learner uh, that ended in the top 80 in the IEB. She ended up with eight distinctions, um, math, science, biology, uh, engineering, graphics and design. So she did extremely well. Um, but there were others at the top end, uh, a child with seven distinctions, uh, another child with five distinctions. So a really excellent set of results. This school is a nature-based school, so we do everything a normal school does except we incorporate it more into environmental studies and more in touch with nature. So all of, most of our subjects we try and link with our surroundings and the nature and it's fitting that we're in this little game reserve because we can go outside in most of our lessons and we can go interact with the nature that we're speaking about. Southern Cross's bush location offers a very special boarding experience for the learners. The campus is a safe, stimulating environment and a home away from home. The 36-bed Jackalberry Lodge caters for the college boys. The 30-bed Tambuti Lodge caters for college girls. Tambuti also houses a five-bed annex for preparatory school boys. I reckon you should come to Southern Cross School mainly because they, these people around here are all your family. We are all one great big family. The bush here is just incredible. It's a different environment. There's people here, they just look out for you all the time. You've got the boarding house mothers here, boarding house fathers, it's, it's incredible. Both boarding and day scholars benefit from the wide range of sports facilities on the school grounds. Swimming pool, tennis and netball courts, and cricket nets. There is a large grass sports field for soccer, hockey, cricket, and athletics. They enjoy the time they spend outside of the classroom with their friends. It's an opportunity for them to really get to know their peers. Um, often the two grades are mixed in an age group, in a team, and so it also gives the children an opportunity to get to know children from the other classes as well. Grade four, I started by playing for Limpopo under 13, and then grade five, I made the under 16 team at the age of 12, six under 16 team at the age of 13, and this year hopefully make the under 16 team again. Southern Cross offers a wide range of extramural activities. These include chess, photography, drama, as well as karate and horse riding. Adventure sports include mountain biking, rock climbing, and kayaking. I believe the thing is, something like kayaking will definitely build someone's leadership skills because you can't exactly kayak alone, you have to kayak in a group. I think as kids grow up, particularly in big mainstream school, there's a lot of stress and pressure, and I think some of that is good but actually being able to balance it is great. And I think that prepares them better for their futures. One of the advantages of Southern Cross is that we actually teach the kids or enable them in a young age to have a balanced life. And that's what I love about this thing. Clubs and committees provide learners with the structures to develop their interests, passions and leadership skills while playing an active role in the life of the school. Cultural activities are also an important part of school life. Southern Cross learners excel at nationalised Steadfords in drama, dance, music and poetry. The creativity of the children in this school is incredible. Um, that's the most important thing, the confidence, their enjoyment on stage, their expression. They're very talented. Southern Cross has attracted the skills of highly regarded and experienced teaching staff from all over South Africa, all of whom have a deep love and commitment to teaching and to the environment. Oh, it's been rejuvenating to come here as a teacher, um, coming from a big city school um, to this environment where the learners actually enjoy coming to school, believe it or not. Um, when they get to the end of the holiday, they're quite happy to come back to school. Um, and for a teacher, that's refreshing, um, to be thanked at the end of the lesson for having taught the, taught the learners. And to see the effort that they put in um, is extremely rewarding at Southern Cross. It's also really great for the teachers because all the teachers are involved in sport and that's where you really get to know your children. Um, in the classroom you often see a different side to what you see on the sports field. I love what we have as a, an ethos. I love what we use our environment for. But I think above all, going back to the kids being kids, I love the children that we're working with. I think they are just, they really are grounded. They are, a, it's a different type of child. It's the quality of life. It's 
just, it's healthy, it's natural, it's outdoors, it's friendly, it's, it's vibey. I'm very impressed by the good morals and values and ethos of the learners of this school. And we also like the idea of a holistic education where our children would learn um, not just a normal school stuff, but would actually benefit from being at school in the bush. And in fact, the day we arrived here, two giraffes walked through the, this, this very area and that was enough for us. We were delighted after that and we thought this would be a great place for us, our kids to come to school. Woodsbrad's a great little town where all of your child's needs will be met. The school has a nurse and there are excellent local GPs. The Hoodspread area provides several unique educational experiences for outings and class trips. Children regularly visit game reserves, hike in our beautiful mountains and get to take part in the life of the town and community. Learners participate in community service. Through its Reach Across program, the school provides workshops for a number of disadvantaged schools in the area. Well, it's really important for our children to understand that they're part of a much broader community and ultimately to understand just how privileged they are to be in a school like this and that the majority of people in this country don't have that same privilege. So it's, a, it's, it's an attempt to educate our children to that but also to share the resources that we have. You must come to Southern Cross because you learn, you discover, you explore, you have loads of fun and you get prepared in the most amazing way for the big world out there. Southern Cross Schools operates under the mantle of a registered trust. It is administered by a board of governors and has a very active parents association.